Good morning, people. Windy today, really windy. Gale force winds, I think. If I'm not careful, I'll get blown away. <laughs> what do you think gust of wind will blow me away, people? Uh, I'm just at Scotty's yard. He's got a roller gone on his, uh, what's that thing called? Shredder. Of the conveyor belt roller. Got a new roller. And they made a meal out of explaining me what the problem was. Basically, what the problem is, is that bolt there needs cutting down the same length as that. So then they can fit it in the roller. Well, I can fit it in the roller. I don't know. I don't know. Uh, Jesus. Look at this. I left this all weekend, look. Friday, put tools away, and then boom! Look at that. And obviously, I went out this morning, forgot to unload all my, all my scrap. Didn't have a tidy up, as you do. There's my grind. <laughs> I've just remembered, I did use it the weekend, so it's still at home. Left outside on the garden floor, I think. Good job I've got a grinder here. Now I need to find a washer. <laughs> I turned my boots away and dreamed about you. And there's the roller, like, the, the new roller anyway. And that new roller goes in there, look. From there to there. And it's on this thing here. This is a shredder. And it shreds stuff with these teeth here that go round. It's very good stuff. It's very thrilling. Well, why the lads couldn't do this, I'm sure. Yeah, that's too long at all. Bloody hell. Go back to the grinder. Right, I've cut them down shorter now. There's no need to struggle, is there, people? I can't do this to cut the line up. It won't go over it. It's like a magnetic ticket. Well, I don't know what it is. It's like pushing it away anyway. So all the lads don't want to do this, innit? Just an simple job. What I've got to do is go bolted. I can't go over you, see, because the cross members there. I'll tell you what, I'm making a meal of this job, innit? Oh, finally, got it. Jeez. Everything you touch is a bloody struggle, people. The next job called for the big boys, to be honest. Yeah. Right, this little fall, if this is new to these lot, because they've got that many fault lifts out of commission, got an oil leak on there, one can't go seal for. Uh, this one, uh, I, I've never seen this before, first time I've seen it. They've only had it for like a week or so, and it don't start now, apparently. I don't know, I haven't even looked at it. Well, I've said it just don't start. Ah, uh, we've got ignition. Nothing at the key. Got a seat sensor on it. Do you need your handbrake on? No. It'll fall down on my head, the lid will. Oh, where are I? There's the start of there, look. Right, so. What's this? Fucking supply relay here, look. Oh, there's a wire off here, look. That's the starter wire, I bet. That's the signal wire. What's the betting? So, this must have gone. So, what I'm going to do with that, you see, that spade fitting there must have widened up. So, I'm going to do this. See? Pinch that together now with my teeth. Right, try it. Pre-press. 
perfect. One running little forklift. I just thought to myself, I best check all the water on this, Anna. It's lovely. Even the cool looks lovely. How long this will last, I do not know. A week, two weeks? <laughs> that was a quick little flying visit. Uh, I've got to go now. I'm not even meant to be here, really. I'm meant to be looking after our birdie, but you know what it's like. You get these little problems and you have to go out, don't you? So that was a nice little flying visit, that. Let me get out of here before somebody gets smashed. <laughs> this will be added to another video. <laughs> so keep watching. Like and subscribe. <laughs> Stupid idea they are. I've just been trying to top up the gearbox oil on it. Oh, there's no there's no top upper on the gearbox on it. Morning people. I've got a massive day today. A massive day. I've got to uh, go and do an MOT prep, do some repairs on it. Got to steam clean it off, brake test it. Uh, I've got to go to Scotty's because he's got his shredded iron. I've got to go to one of my mates' house because his van's not starting. Oh, I've got loads to do. Me and Lady, I've got a busy day today. We're starting late and all because we've been messing around all morning. <laughs> I'm laid dag. I mean, it's about, about dinner time now, you know. Oh. And as well, woke up this morning, got something in my eye. I must have got it last night in bed, I don't know how. Feels like a bit of grit in my eye, or a bit of steel or something in my eye. Bloody job. Gets worse, doesn't it? Right, come on, laid dag, we've got to go. Let's go, people. Let's start the day's work, laid dag, finally. Oh, now my toolbox is open. Piss. I've got to wait for him now, it'll be 45 minutes. Uh, My eyes freaking killing me. You know when the sun shines in your eyes as well, it's like, Jesus, it starts watering that, I'll keep rubbing it. Yeah, I'm waiting now, playing the waiting game, innit? I? I didn't realise he was out in it. I thought he would be here, but he's not, he's out in it. So I'm in a right freaking rock and roll place now, innit? I've got loads to do and all, but I've got to wait here because I've got to do that test prep before I do anything because that's more important than out, innit? Because I've got a test tomorrow morning. Oh dear, what a nightmare. The long wait is over. He is here, so now I can get on. About one o'clock now. All right, first thing I've got to do is put a load on it. it takes 10 tonne legally, so you need 60% of what it can carry, so at least needs six tonne on it. I don't sound very good, does it? Oh, what's up? Oh, God, dodgy starter. Oh, this is the one with the ring gear. It's got a dodgy bit on the ring gear. Lovely little do. Wants a bit of grease on that, doesn't it? Squeaking. That's what I like, a nice quick load. Got to muck this cab out and all, haven't I? I've got a lap to fit here, look. There. Let's hope it's got power to it. <laughs> Be fine. Cosmetics, that. Just cosmetical. That's off, look. Yeah, I need to push the brakes up. And I need to take the brake test, really, if I can get in. Needs a good wash down and all, doesn't it? At least now the brakes will be bedding. You said I did some pads on this the other day, so we've been using it, so it's good. It'll be nice to be bedding. Oh, that's handy. I can get in now for the brake test just around the corner here. So I'll just adjust these back brakes up and then we'll go for brake test. <gasps> it's all coming together, isn't it? All of a sudden. Right, now we're off to brake test. <laughs> Yeah, it passed, but near side rear didn't lock out. Uh, it's just, it's just a matter of looking at drawing it tomorrow. Obviously, tomorrow when I take the test, I'm taking it to a different testing station. So it all depends on the day, doesn't it? Looks about right, doesn't it, people? Yeah. Just fit a new two pin bulb in there. I'll notice this lot condensation on the bloody headlight. Ah, that's no good for test. 
I'll tell you what I'm going to do, take the lens off, look. take these clips off, take the lens off and, and uh, dry it out, innit? Because uh, it'll send the, uh, it'll send the, what do you call it? What do you call it? The beam like off, won't it? I don't know, whatever it is. Right, get the pressure washer out now. Dun, dun, dun. It's the fire machine. Right, let's strike this beast up. Straggle bass, bloody good bass, bloody good bass. I'm closing your window, lay dog, so you don't get wet, lay dog. He wants his chair, don't you, lay dog? He ain't got his chair. Took it out, didn't we? I need to put it back though. Poor lay dog, he's getting cold now. Are you all right there, lay dog? Look at that now, it's like a new pin to both are, aren't they? Bloody good job, man. Right, let's whip this lens off and get this condensation away. Naughty condensation. How did it get in there? Why is it even there, people? Hey, it must, must not have a seal very good. Come on, let's have you out. I think what I'm going to do is, when I pour it back on, I'm going to pour a bit of silicon around there, because I think it's, them clips are a bit weak. I think that's why it's getting condensation in it. Oh, I'm a messy twat I am, innit? Bloody hell. Got silicon every bloody where. Everywhere but where I wanted it, people. Ah, oh. <laughs> oh, dearie me. <laughs> people. Get in there. Stay in there. Oh, piss off. Bloody hell. He's pissing clips. Ah, there we go. There, good as new. Go. Right, uh, what do I need to do? I need to pause it, really, because I need some marker boards for the back. What I haven't got. Oh. Uh, hey, I just thought to myself, and all getting this grind, uh, my eye's better now, which is good. Until I stop grinding, they get a switch in it. I'm running deadly short of my nuts, bolts and washers, you know. Been rooting around in that van. And I tell you what, you can soon spend a bit of money on nuts, bolts and washers, can't you? You know, you know, like, uh, using them every now and again. Oh, 8 mil bolt here, 6 mil bolt there, 12 mil bolt there, washers and all that lot. And then at the end of it, after six months, you you you, you need to replace them all. It's going to cost you about 150 quid just, just, just to replace your nuts, bolts and washers. Sick man, isn't it? Especially when you don't charge out for them. Ha! Bloody hell! Bloody charity event, Chris! That's lovely, you see? Right, next part to get them marker boards. Uh, yeah, let's, let's do it. I've got to get them stuck on tonight, you see, so it's dry in the morning. Or else, if I stick them on it just before the test, I'll be dropping off, aren't I? <laughs> I could drill them like, but I can't be bothered. Simple. It's the wrong time of the day to come here, isn't it? Five o'clock. Bad idea that was, wasn't it? Hey, all, all, the, all the traffic's coming out of all the industrial estate now. I'm going to get right snarled up on my way out, isn't it? Right, let's pop these on. Ah, did you see that there? I bent them over a lot, you see, so then you don't have to hold them in place and they'll, they'll stay up there. You with me? They won't drop like down overnight. That's what 
on preventing here, you see, people. Look at that, people. Look at that. That's a wonderful job, Chris. It looks like brand new, Chris. Yes, it does. I agree. It does look like brand new. See? That's a new. <laughs> right, me and Lady Dag are going. We'll see you in the morning, won't we, Lady Dag? Wish me luck for a test in the morning. Yay! Yeah, she's passed, guys. Luckily, she's passed. A few advisories, but uh, the main thing is she passed one test. That was the main. That was the main thing. I think it's because I had Lady Dag with me. My lucky my my lucky mascot. That, oh, he looks cold in there, don't he? Because he ain't got his seat, look. Poor little dad. Oh, I've got to top my water up now. I know the water's still pissing low, innit? Uh, right, guys, I'll catch you lot on the next one. Perhaps I'll be fixing my van on the next one. <laughs> I won't be because I've got more stuff to do. Catch you on the next one, guys. See you in a bit. Woo -woo! Yeah, you will.